Nobody, DB Cooper, after taking over a plane and demanding $200,000 in 20s. I, I'm a head out. And he was never seen again. He's probably just been living it up in South America for a few decades. That or his remains are somewhere in Oregon. This is quite possibly still one of the biggest mysteries out there. Like, who was this guy? Stella Lieback suffers third degree burns due to excessive hot coffee. Sues McDonald's for $20,000 to cover medical expenses. The American media. You're just looking for attention. I remember this. It was everywhere. I feel like every late night comedian was making fun of this woman. This lady was just trying to pay for all her injuries. The Arab Caliphate, the Seljuk Sultanate, and the Ottoman Empire versus Byzantium protecting the rest of Europe. Square the F up, thoughts. Ah yes, when I think of these Islamic empires, I also think of thoughts. Sadly, he was only able to hold them back for so long. The French populace literally dying of starvation. Mary Antoinette in the Palace of Versailles. We have Hat, Hat again. Oh, and Hat 3, just showing off these bad boys. What's kind of cool is that this was kind of like a foreshadow all these pictures she was literally gonna look like this one day with just her head and that's it Rasputin tells doctors to stop giving Alexi aspirin since it's a blood thinner Nicholas be like what kind of magical BS is this I love how just basic understanding of how things work would make you a wizard back in the day but then again this might be a case of a broken clock being right twice a day Sparta replying with if after Philip II threatens to devastate Spartan lands Sparta after Philip II invades Laconia and devastates the northern half Side note, but I despise this gift so much. I literally cannot explain my hatred for these few seconds of film. Plato writing his Socratic dialogues and winning debates against himself. Aristotle trying to create a process of reasoning to help man understand everything. Diogenes being Diogenes. Oh, I actually thought this was the president of China for a second there. I was a little confused. General Howe, oh no, my dog has wandered onto the battlefields. The enemy were surely oof him. Meanwhile, George Washington and the dog. I guess Washington fed the dog and cleaned the dog and then actually returned the dog. This has got to be up there as one of his greatest achievements. Mary, Queen of the Scots, gets beheaded in the botched execution, which takes three strikes of the axe. The dog hiding under her dress. Pretty hilarious, because if there was actually a cat under the dress, oh, you know that thing would have enjoyed it. Cats would have helped the execution go faster. They'd remember all the times you didn't feed them enough. Finland, we will never join the no-no Germans. No-no Germans, here's some soldiers and missiles to help you against Stalin. Finland quickly has a nice change of heart, I guess. Well, I guess they drive a hard bargain. I mean, they pretty much just got bought off. Choosing a normal name for your insurgency organization, MILF. I mean, yeah, I guess that's kind of a normal name on some no-no websites that might be visited. I would start a country too if I could name it MILF. Constantine the Great showing Christianity to the Roman Empire. Strange, but effective. It was actually super effective. The United Fruit Company every time a South American government starts talking about land redistribution or workers' rights. About to get shanked by this banana. They're like, so you have chosen death. Hello? Hello? Can you hear us? We are broadcasting the last Polish radio communication. Today, German troops entered Warsaw. Poland is not yet lost. Long live for Poland. Polish anthem plays. The British radio operator receiving this message. Ooh, that has got to be rough. Strange, because the anthem is actually pretty nice and happy. That's got to be a really weird combination. Something you don't even consider, just radio broadcast back in those days. What do you do when your country's about to fall? When the French use tear gas, so you reply by unleashing the lung-melting mustard gas. Oh. Almost lost my cool there. Nope, nope, you definitely did not overreact. A little bit of spicy wind can't do too much damage, can it? Alexander after conquering the known world at 25. Alexander wanting to be as successful as his dad at age 20. Sorry, man, but you're five years too late. You might as well give up. This is all for nothing. Maybe if you tried to start conquering stuff at a little bit of an earlier age, it would have helped. Congress passes the Prohibition Act of 1920. The people during that era who rebelled. Legitimately, for a whole decade, everything just turned into to a giant anime episode. It actually did seem like a pretty integral part of our arc though. Americans chilling in the middle of Antarctica at whatever station this is. Two big ass Soviet treaded that things and an at at rolling up out of nowhere a day after Christmas. Uh, not an at at, but I am imagining like the Star Wars things moving through the snow. That seems like it'd be pretty useful in a place like Antarctica. We should probably make those in real life. Hugh Glass, who survived in the wilderness despite being severely wounded, reaching this fort after traveling 200 miles. His colleagues who abandoned him after he was attacked by a bear. Wait. 
that is this was this about that Leonardo DiCaprio movie is this the plot of the Revenant I was gonna say like I don't remember them ever saying it was based on a true story and the first photo I see inspired by true events it seemed real I just don't remember them marketing it as like a real story Hungary trying to leave the Axis and make a peace deal with the Allies Germany who ain't gonna let them pull it Italy slash Romania so easily it's happened one too many times they can't let this happen again Germany America Britain Russia yeah Russia is always willing to just do whatever they have to do I mean as long as they look the part who really cares right the thought that counts the Germans leave the task of defending the left flank of Stalingrad to the Italians and Romanians August 2nd 1942 just kind of throwing them right in the deep end yeah we don't really feel like it anymore we're just gonna completely mess this up you thought that was bad just wait till you see what the Italians did in the African front we gathered all the tiktokers in one okay all right mm. I'll allow it as long as they're doing one last TikTok dance right before these things hit. I want to see it on video. All body shapes are beautiful. Mine too? Uh, yeah, no. This is actually what Keemstar looks like if he shaved. Small towns in the US versus small towns in Europe. Oh, I don't want to read all this. After a journey through the desert for 37 days and 45 nights, Ligma Jr. founded Ligmaville. Extremely honorable man. Choose not to wipe out natives. He beat the natives on a game of Uno. That's why the town is here. Okay. Versus Europe that's just like, what do you mean, history? People just lived here. They always did. Love the realness of that. This town is literally thousands of years old. Where do you want to start? Russian Cossacks being like, Welcome to the Himalayas! Napoleon's men literally dying of hypothermia and having no clue how to deal with guerrilla warfare. Also, Napoleon realizing he should have just called it a day after Spain. Imagining the Russian Cossacks as just giant yeti monsters seems pretty accurate, actually. The Confederate States, we're succeeding in forming our own country. The USA, well, hold on. Let's talk about Confederate Army attacks this fort. Now use can't leave. Union soldiers have entered the chat. The Portuguese opening up this box. The rest of the world being amazed by deep fried food. So that's who I get to thank for having diabetes at the age of 12. Honestly, I can't tell what was a better Portuguese creation anymore. The deep fried food or Brazil? It's gotta be close. Titanic passengers. Hey, this cruise is really fun. Can't wait to get to New York and tell everyone about our journey. Titanic passengers a couple hours later. Oh, oh. Oh, all right. I didn't think, I didn't think that was where this was going. I mean, I knew it was where it was going. I just didn't know he was gonna use that. The Dutch in the 17th century, literally just jumping into a bunch of money. Everyone else just depressed as hell. Maybe you guys should also think about being 50% C, 50% weed. Week 25 of Gaddafi maxing. I'm only 22, so I had to use special creams to accelerate my facial aging. I got the hair almost down to a T. And now I'm working on the mustache. I'll keep you guys posted. Being born Mexican really helped this. <laughs> This time, how many other former North African leaders have you tried to roleplay as? Or am I confused, is this guy just reincarnating but he remembers all his previous lives? South American country democratically elects a socialist leader. The USA, hey, hey. How did she say it? I don't know how she says it. I'm not even gonna attempt to say it the way she does. Warsaw during the 1944 uprising. The Russians, a few miles away. Oh, uh, another tragedy of Poland. Every time you look into their history, it just continues to get more sad. So who are you putting forward to the jury for a Nobel Prize for literature nomination? C.S. Lewis, knowing he's just going to nominate his best mate J.R. Tolkien. I know, just the one. Oh, that's so nice, and I would have never known it if it wasn't for this meme. Scary how often that happens, how often a little meme will teach you something for the rest of your life. Hopefully that's accurate, though. I guess that's the thing. When you run across the border from Greece to Bulgaria and cause an international incident after your owner chases after you and ends up getting shot. Whoops. We have a lot of dogs coming up today. This one went straight up demon mode. He was trying to cause World War III. Not all dogs are good boys, I guess. Actually, I guess this happened in 1925, so World War II just a little early. What the dog doing? I had to say that line once. That feeling when you're a crowd of starving people, but then some magic dude shows up and manages to multiply seven loaves of bread and a couple of fish. Just wait till you get to see what he does with the water. They're definitely gonna be looking like this after that. Metallica releases the Black Album. The record companies, oh dear, oh dear, gorgeous hardcore metal fans. You freaking donkey. Was this that album from the 90s that like changed so much? Yeah, this is when they became super famous. 1991, Enter Sandman, The Unforgiven, Nothing Else Matters. But you know what? It's it's all gonna become full circle. This is gonna be Metallica's reaction when a 12 year old downloads their song from Napster a couple years later. Russian command, yeah. Just send the armored brigade into the town and take it. Not like the citizens are gonna do anything. The citizens of Gronsny. I even like come close to pronouncing that right? Well, whatever this place is, I wanna go there if they're all looking like this. They look like they know how to party. This Soviet guy, nothing is wrong with the fourth reactor. The fourth reactor in Ukraine sometime in the 80s. Yeah, it normally just does that. I love smelling radiation in the air. Competes in single skulls event in 1928 Olympics. Row into early lead against Vincent in the quarterfinals as family of ducks stray into lane. 
refuses to row through them, stops to let them pass, and finishes the race with the fastest time in the quarterfinals. Refuses to elaborate further. Why did you just stop when the ducks were in front of you? He just looks back with a completely blank face. No, no, Germans. We have your son, Joe. Give us back our field marshal and nobody gets hurt. Stalin. Whoa, that's interesting, but I sure don't care. You think they told his son this right before they oofed him? Well, your dad doesn't care, so I guess we gotta remove you from Earth. Stalin. Yes, we will have fair elections. Also, Stalin. We all be together, including you. Got it? Wait, what is that word that they tried to cross off? I would like to see the true history of when he actually says this. That sounds like a fun time. Our generals are incompetent and keep having us fight in the hellish conditions of the Alps for the same strips of land. Every offensive has failed. Austria-Hungary is seen as a laughingstock by every other major power. Minutes later, OMG, the king is visiting us on the front lines. Well, yeah, I mean, who wouldn't be like that when someone has such a glorious stash? That's all I would need to sacrifice my life. Come to the WW2 Chinese front. We have literal sword fights, flying sharks girl power and oh that's yeah those are the no no german helmets but those are not no no german soldiers that's weird 60,000 czechoslovakian legionaries leave russia in 1920 after fighting behind enemy lines for two years occupying all the trans-siberian railway winning the first czechoslovakian naval battle and capturing the russian gold reserve my watch is ended now that's a story i've never heard of before surprised this isn't memed more often um guys you haven't seen the australian prime minister have you the australian prime minister just dead in a bunch of water this guy's name was harold Holt in 1966. He went swimming and never came back. Me versus me after commercial color photography becoming available in 1898. Wow, what a difference. Looks at 3D and everything. Didn't know just color can make things look almost animated. And big thanks to the September patrons. Max Cooper. Majestic Unicorn. I love Mark. Drew's a sussy bucka. Changed Drew's my mind. thick girl Braxton girlfriend. Drew's Argentinian grandpa. Bring back Poland Bowl. Arian After Hours. Alfonso M6. Barnsky W. Dalton D. Poulsen Luxembourg Lover. Nick Blorf. Mine Brothers 999 X2. Poppy Drew Woo. Patrick C. Elijah Senpai. And Stormtrooper 501. Thank you.